Hi, I'm Brooke. <laughs> nice to have y'all back. Let me put y'all on a stand. Hi Brooke, what are we starting for you today? Um, I want to try the new Paradise drink. No problem. Can I get that in a grande and with coconut milk? You guys, I forgot to get Kyle's cake pop. Oh no. I'll add it on at the window. Um, is it possible to add on a cake pop? No, yeah, you can add it. Sorry. <laughs> That's all right. Birthday cake pop. We also just came out with the cookies and cream one as well. Oh, really? Can yeah. I get that one too? Yeah. Thank so, you. One birthday one. Cookie. Yeah. yeah. And also, would you like to try it just to make sure you like it? Um, sure. Okay. <laughs> so, it just came out and like, I'd like to make sure. So now we can make you something. Okay. Good. She was so sweet. Oh my gosh, I low-key kind of ruined the first impression taste test, but that's okay. We'll go over it. So let me park and then we'll do like the full shabam. <laughs> okay, we're almost there. Promise. I just had to go through this little... Oh, hello. I just had to go through that little shopping center. Um, yeah. Uh, hi. <laughs> You're way over there. I'm way over here. <laughs> Today, I am trying the brand new Paradise Drink. First of all, I love the name. Second of all, it is pineapple and mango, and I'll give you a little bit of information on it. I already got it. It is just like the strawberry acai refresher and the mango dragon fruit. You can get it just pineapple and mango, just like the regular Paradise Drink. You can get it with coconut milk, which is what I got, because I thought it'd be super good. And then you can get it with lemonade, which I think would be like the perfect summer hot drink. You know, like I picture beach in this drink. Like that's how I picture it. I want to read um, what it says on the Starbucks app of like, you know, what it's supposed to taste like. If anybody cares, it's 140 calories um, with coconut milk, freeze dried pineapple, and it is tropical flavors of pineapple and passion fruit combined with diced pineapple and creamy coconut milk to create a delicious island escape. Got 23 grams of sugar for people who watch their sugar and two grams of fat. I know I've been kind of trying to watch my sugar intake a little bit too. So just wanted to put that out there. She told me that somebody told her to put to add on raspberry syrup in this drink to really bring out the passion fruit flavor. So I told her I'm definitely gonna have to try that next time. But someone told me to try it with the coconut milk and raspberry syrup to get the passion fruit in it, mm -hmm. and it's so good with the raspberry syrup. So, oh really? Yeah. Okay, I'll try that yeah. next time. No <laughs> Today we are just trying the paradise drink with coconut milk. So let me go ahead and taste it. it the color's super pretty. Mm. It's so good. Okay, so you don't get a lot of passion fruit, you just get a touch of it probably why they recommend to add raspberry syrup in it but by itself it's like pineapple happiness like it's not like over saturated in just pineapple like you got pineapple and then you got just that touch of passion fruit it's so good it's so summery and it's super super refreshing it's a beautiful drink for a beautiful day and the freeze-dried pineapples I actually don't mind they taste pretty good I'm not a fan of the freeze fr freeze dried strawberries but the pineapples do not bother me at all and I feel like if you love pineapple you will like this drink but it may not be as pineapple-y as you may want it to be if you are not a huge pineapple person but you kind of like it in certain things I think you will love this drink if you don't like pineapple at all maybe try the raspberry syrup in it to bring more of that passion fruit flavor but I think a lot of people are gonna like this drink I'm not just saying that because it just came out um, and to hype it up but this is really good I really like it and I kind of got tired of the strawberry acai 
uh, refreshers, so it's so nice to have something new that's not like sour like the star fruit one. Mmm. It's so good. Sorry, I got a piece of pineapple. Some of them are kind of hard though. The pineapple chunks are a little hard. <laughs> I might have to, you know, sit in the drink a little longer to soften up, but the drink itself is amazing. I definitely recommend it for sure. I'm kind of curious what it tastes like without the coconut milk because the coconut milk just gives it that creaminess. Like it's so good. I love it. That is definitely going to be my new go-to drink for summer. Um, I'm kind of happy I found something to where I don't have to keep getting just like coffee at Starbucks. I don't know. It doesn't make me thirsty, <laughs> but it's really refreshing, really good. Highly, highly recommend you guys try it. And yeah, 10 out of 10, kind of like a thousand out of 10. I love it. Um, I will definitely be trying it with raspberry syrup for sure. And she also said that they have the new cookies and cream cake pop. Let me show you what that looks like right there. So that's fun. Obviously it's probably gonna taste like cookies and cream. Oh my god. Oh, mmm. Oh, <laughs> that is so good. Mmm. The chocolate cake. Oh my god, it smells so good. I could smell that all day. I'm gonna leave a little bit so Kyle can try it. Oh my god, that is better than the birthday cake and it is way better than just the regular chocolate that is so good I oh my god y'all need to get this cake pop and you guys need to try that drink so good this whole video is a win <laughs> please 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 give it a like I would so appreciate it and if you did enjoy this video and want to see more by me be sure to check out more videos and also subscribe down below I think it was very sweet that she asked me to try it because it was new and just in case I didn't like it she was gonna make me another drink that was so sweet um, I've never had anybody ask me you know that and asked me to do that so I didn't want to be rude and be like oh no like I'm sure it's fine so I did take a little sip just a little smidgen and I could try and I could tell that you know that I was going to like it and um, even if I didn't like it I wasn't going to tell her that <laughs> I didn't want to just get like I don't you know what I mean like I love this Starbucks so much it's my local Starbucks so but I hope you guys are having a great day. I hope you guys are having a great week. And I'm so sorry I have not been uploading as much. Um, I'm going to try and get back into uploading. I know a lot of you guys like my Starbucks videos. They seem to do really well. And I know a lot of you like vlogs. Also, if you love Disney, check out my Disney channel. It'll be linked down below. And also, I have a Disney Instagram and a regular Instagram. And same with TikTok. I'd love for you guys to follow me or, you know, check it out. It'll all be linked down below. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.